Hi Gav, here we are on the eve of a new season. No doubt you reflect positively on last season. What are your hopes for this season? The hopes are that we continue to grow. The hopes are that we continue to improve. And, and the hopes are that you improve upon your your outcomes from last year, if you like. Um, it's an exciting time of year. Um, you know, it's been difficult for the lads, I suppose, in terms of like the, the duration of pre-season, if you like. But um, there's an enthusiasm within the camp. I felt that of the players, particularly this week in training. Um, same with the staff. There's um, a level of excitement over what the season might bring. Um, but it's all got to be built on sort of humbleness and, and hard work. And, you know, I uh, firmly believe that in the league season you end up where you deserve to be. I think if we can show that hard work, that togetherness, that, that honesty that we've always shown, then uh, hopefully we can look forward to another exciting year. Uh, we've obviously brought six new additions into the squad so far, this transfer window. Uh, what, do we, what do those players bring to the squad? Um, they all bring something different, to be fair. Um, you know, George as a, as, a, as a keeper is extremely talented. Um, you know, I've seen that first time in training and in games so far, so I'm excited to, to be working with him. Luke uh, coming as a right back. Um, I think that we can provide a really good environment for him to get the best out of what I think he's capable of. And we've seen fits and fits and starts of that in pre-season so far. But I know there's so much more to come from him. Um, and a great lad who's fitted right into the changing room. Having Callum back um, is a real boost to the changing room. Callum's a real old head on young shoulders. Um, got some serious talent, and I think that we've got a, a really good sort of environment to to allow him to get the best out of himself as well. Um, Jack. Brings well, he brings league quality. To be fair to him, you know, you don't play that amount of leagues and in, in in that type of football and that type of level without having good quality. Um, but again, I think that the brand of football we have will, will suit Jack, and I think he'll bring some creativity and some quality to the team. Um, Keon and Eli, um, Keon's back in the the JD Cymru uh, Premier now, um, and that's a good thing for the league because you know he's a local lad, he's a, a very good player. And I think he'll bring more competition and quality in the, the top end of the field. Um, and, and Eli um, comes with a good pedigree. Um, I suffered like Keon, I suppose, last year in terms of injuries. So I don't expect to see the best of those until probably October, November time. Um, but again, brings, brings quality and brings um, a different type of uh, finisher, if you like, in the final third. So really excited to be working with all those guys. Obviously, the EPL deadline day has come and gone today. But can we expect any movement at Barry before the end of our transfer window? Um, probably, yeah, probably. Um, whether that's in, we'll have to see what happens. You know, my job as a manager is to make sure that if I think we can improve the team, um, I ask the board to, to see if they'll back us, and uh, you know, we have to do that. So the truth is, we don't know, but that could happen. Uh, there might be one or two uh, moving out, um, such as the nature of competition, if you like. Um, That'll probably be on a loan basis to start off with, just to, to make sure that lads are playing football and make sure that the squad is, is lean but, but very competitive. So, yeah, we'll see, but probably is the answer. Uh, looking ahead now to Haverford West this weekend in the JD Welsh Cup, what are we expecting from that game? Well, you know, Haverford West will, prob will have designs on getting back into the, uh, the JD Cymru Premier next year, so I know they'll be competitive. Um, you know, I know Wayne, the manager, well. I know that they'll have them well organised. They've they've made some good signings themselves in pre-season. Um, but you know, it's it's a chance for us to to get rid of pre-season, if you like, and, and start the games in earnest now. And uh, I know that'll bring the best out of the lads. I expect it to be a difficult game. Um, it's a cup game, so anything can happen. But it's a game, as I mentioned earlier, we approach with excitement, we approach with enthusiasm, and a high level of humbleness. Cheers, Gav. Thank you.